Oh, hello, friends. We have finally met. Come to me. We will have dinner together. <clears throat> JJ, did you see that? That car just hit that girl and sped off. We need to do something. Yeah, I saw it. That was crazy. We can't just leave her here. She's unconscious. Let's get her to a hospital. No, no hospitals. That's my wife. We need to get her home. I can take care of her there. Your wife? Mikey, why didn't you tell me? All right, let's get her to your place. But we need to call an ambulance at least. No, JJ, I can't risk it. There are reasons. Please help me get her to my place. I'll explain everything late. All right, fine. Let's get her to your place then. But if anything goes wrong, it's on you, Mikey. Thank you, JJ. I owe you big time for this. Let's hurry. She needs help fast. Don't mention it, Mikey. We're friends, right? JJ, quick, wash your hands. We need to prepare for the operation. Wait, what? Mikey, I'm not a doctor. I don't know anything about surgery. I know, JJ, but we don't have a choice. Mikey, where did you go? We can't do this without you. Okay, I have no other choice anyway. I'll make sure my hands are sparkling clean. I need to go see if Mikey is back yet. JJ, I know this sounds insane, but we're running out of time. I need your help. I need you to enter my body and retrieve my heart for the transplant. Whoa, Mikey, are you serious? That's some sci-fi stuff right there. I don't know if I can do this. I know it's a lot to ask, JJ, but I trust you. These devices will guide you and keep you safe inside me. Please, we're running out of options. All right, Mikey. If this is what it takes to save her, I'll do it. Let's get this over with. Thank you, JJ. I owe you more than words can express. Are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be, Mikey. Let's do this. Okay, Mikey, I'll do my best. Just wish me luck. Here goes nothing. Okay, deep breaths. You can do this. Just focus on the task at hand. All right, entering Mikey's body now. Oh boy, this is surreal. All right, let's find that heart. Whoa, this is intense. All right, focus, JJ. Ignore the distractions. I need to stay on track. There's the stomach and all that food. Stay focused, JJ. You can't let this slow you down. Gotta keep moving towards the heart. All right, focus. I've got a mission here. Got to navigate through this maze of organs and tissues to reach the heart. Stay determined. Keep moving forward. Yes, found the heart. Now I need to carefully extract Mikey's heart. This is it. No room for mistakes. All right, let's do this. I think he would be only for us to do this. Got the heart. Now time to head back. Whoo, this is nerve wracking. All right, just follow the path back. Almost there. All right, let's do this. Here goes nothing. Stay with us, Mikey's girl. You're gonna make it through this. Come on, Hart, you've gotta work with us here. Mikey's wife needs you. Okay, let's try again. All right, here we go. Let's hope this time it works. Oh, it seems like it's taking this time. Just a little longer. Ooh, that was intense. Now we wait, I guess. Everything's going to be all right. We did everything we could, and now it's just a matter of time. Stay positive, JJ. She's in good hands. Looks like the transplant was successful this time. Oh no, this isn't good. I need to snap out of it. Mikey's wife needs help. I have to find a way to call a doctor. Come on, get it together. I need to find a phone or some way to call for help. Mikey's wife's life is on the line. I can't afford to waste any more time. No, I can't pass out now. I need to stay conscious and find a way to help. Where I am? What actually happened? Oh, that's right. Mikey's wife. Mikey, we need to talk. I think we should reconsider the heart transplant. It doesn't seem to be working for your wife, and I believe we need to explore other options together. It's not working out like we hoped, and I don't want to risk your wife's life any further. We can't give up, but we also need to be realistic about what's best for her health. What's happening? I do not understand anything. Mikey, you're awake. Listen, something happened. Your wife, she needed a heart transplant, and I tried to... I tried to use your heart to save her. Mikey, I tried to transplant your heart to your wife, but it didn't work. She couldn't accept it. I returned it to you. Wait, what do you mean she didn't accept it? How is that even possible? I don't know, Mikey. It's complicated, but right now, let's focus on getting to her the medical attention you need. I'll call the ambulance. No, no, wait. What about her? Is she okay? I can't just leave her like this. Mikey, we'll make sure she gets the help she needs. Let's quickly call an ambulance. Hey, stay calm, Mikey. The doctors are professionals. They know what they're doing. Good evening, gentlemen. I understand we have quite a situation here. Let me take a look at the patient. Doctor, please! You have to save her! She means everything to me! I can't lose her!
use her! I'll do anything! Just please do whatever it takes to help her! All right, this is a complex situation indeed. It appears to be a critical stage. We'll need to act fast and decisively. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you so much. We'll make sure to arrange the payment and provide whatever is needed for her treatment. This is a huge relief, Mikey. She's gonna make it through this. We'll support her every step of the way. Thank you once again, Doctor. We owe you everything. Take care of her, please. We'll be in touch to check on her progress. I can't thank you enough, JJ. Without your quick thinking and determination, I don't know what would have happened. You saved her life, man. I couldn't let anything happen to her. Oh no, this is, this is impossible. A million dollars? How are we supposed to come up with that kind of money? We don't have anything close to that. What are we going to do, JJ? I don't know, Mikey. This is beyond anything I imagined. We have to find a way. We can't give up now. Not when she's so close to getting the help she needs. Let's brainstorm. Let's reach out to everyone we know. Maybe there's a solution out there somewhere. But who could possibly help us come up with such a huge sum? I don't even know where to start. We'll figure it out, Mikey. We can't afford to lose hope now. Who could that be at this hour? I'll go check. Can I help you? Good evening, gentlemen. I couldn't help but overhear about your situation. I believe I can offer a solution that benefits all parties involved. And what might that be? I'm willing to buy your house for half a million dollars. It's a generous offer, considering the circumstances. Thank you for your offer, but our house is not for sale at the moment. That's right. We appreciate your interest, but we're exploring other options to fund the treatment. Our home means a lot to us, and we're not willing to part with it under these circumstances. Besides, this house costs much more than half a million dollars. So much money is not enough for us even to treat Mike's wife. Are you sure about this? Think about what I'm offering you. It could change everything for you. Thank you, but we've made up our minds. Goodbye. I can't help but wonder if we made the right decision, JJ. What if that was our best chance to get the money we need for her treatment? It's hard to say, Mikey, but selling our home under pressure like that didn't feel right. We'll find another way. All right, let's give it a shot. Maybe the restaurant owner will be willing to help us out somehow. Good evening, sir. We appreciate you taking the time to speak with us. We're facing a difficult situation and we were hoping you might be able to help us. Yes, we're trying to raise funds for a medical treatment. It's quite urgent. And we're exploring every possible avenue to gather the necessary funds. I'm sorry, gentlemen. I can't offer financial assistance. However, I may have another proposition that could benefit both parties involved. Thank you for considering alternative options, sir. We're eager to hear what you have in mind. There's a task I need your assistance with. I require you to procure a Lamborghini for me. It's parked nearby, but it's a delicate operation. I need it brought to my garage, which, coincidentally, is located near the police station. Wait, steal a Lamborghini? That's quite a risky task. What do you need it for? It sounds like trouble, but if the reward is worth it, we might consider it. What's the plan, and what's in it for us? This is a tough decision, JJ. On one hand, the reward could potentially help us cover the costs of her treatment. On the other hand, stealing a car and risking getting caught by the police is no small matter. We need to weigh the risks and rewards carefully. I agree, Mikey. We need to consider all the consequences. Let's also think about the moral implications of what we're being asked to do. Let's wait for the night. We'll have better cover of darkness to carry out the task without attracting too much attention. All right, JJ, let's do this. Remember, keep quiet and stay low. We need to move swiftly but discreetly. Got it, Mikey. Let's stay focused and stick to the plan. We're just a few minutes away from getting what we need. We can do this. All right, let's stick to the shadows and move quickly. We'll grab the car and get out of here as fast as we can. I don't like this, Mikey, but you're right. We don't have much of a choice at this point. Let's make it quick and get back safely. Remember why we're doing this, JJ. It's all for her. We'll do whatever it takes to save her. I know, Mikey. Let's make it count. We're doing this for her. Let's get to work, JJ. We need to find a way to open this Lamborghini and get it to the garage as quickly as possible. Good call, Mikey. Stay alert, just in case. Great job, JJ. Let's get out of here and head to the garage. We're one step closer to getting the help she needs. Buckle up. We're on our way to the garage. This is it, the final step to securing her treatment. I can't believe it's finally happening. This is going to change everything for her. Let's make sure we get there safely. We're almost there. Just a little bit further and we'll have accomplished what we set out to do. Keep your eyes peeled, JJ. Let's hope everything goes smoothly from here. We made it. Let's hand over the car and get the funds we need. I can't believe we pulled it off. Well, look who decided to show up. Thank you for driving the car for us. 
You can leave. What's going on here? Where's the person who gave us this task? Oh, him. He won't be bothering anyone anymore. Let's just say he won't be making any more deals. Now, as for you two, I'm afraid we can't let you leave here alive. You must follow us. Please, you don't understand. We did what we had to for the sake of saving Mikey's wife. She's in critical condition, and we need all the help we can get. I've had enough of your stories. It's time to stop wasting time. Follow us, now! We don't have much of a choice, JJ. Let's follow them for now, but we need to find a way to turn this situation around. What is this place? Why have you brought us here? No! No, this can't be happening! It's her! Give me the keys and rights to the house, now! We'll do as you say. Just please don't hurt us. We've already lost too much. Get in the grave! I can't believe it. All our efforts, everything we did, it was all for nothing. This is... this is a nightmare. How could they do this? We have to find a way to make them pay for what they've done. I can't believe it. All this for nothing. She's gone. It's it's too much to bear. We did everything we could, Mikey. I'm so sorry. There is no point in living anymore. I will also die here with her. Mikey, I know this is incredibly difficult, but we have to stay strong. We'll find a way through this together. We'll make sure her memory lives on and we'll never forget the love we shared with her. I don't want to live without her. Let's get out of here, Mikey. We need to go to the police and tell them everything. It's the right thing to do, so that these scum don't offend anyone anymore. Okay, we owe it to her to seek justice. We'll make sure those responsible pay for what they've done. Let's climb out of here and head straight to the police station. We'll tell them everything, no matter what it takes. Absolutely. We won't rest until justice is served. Let's go. And Mikey, no matter what happens, we stick together. We're in this together, through thick and thin. Let's do this in memory of my incredible wife. I think she would be all for us doing this. Officer, we need to report a crime. It's urgent. Yes, we have vital information regarding a serious matter. You have to listen to us. It involves the murder of my wife. We know who's responsible, and we're ready to cooperate fully. 